Hi Taurus, it's Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot and I am doing your April 1st through April 8th weekly reading. We're just going to see whatever comes up for the sign of Taurus. What does Taurus need to know for this first week of April? We're going to do these upright today. You know, many of you are coming out of a period of solitude. This is the Hermit card. It feels as though you guys have closed a door. And, you know, I feel as though you have been through a period of contemplation. And um, maybe you had some insecurities that you had to work out. And it feels like because you have taken the time to focus on your inner being and the lessons and the the inner struggles, it feels as though you are moving forward in a very positive way to bring victory and success to your life. I do want to get this zoomed in. I feel as though there, there, you know, that six right there, harmony, that is the lover's card. There is an unexpected choice in love, okay, that could come up this week because you guys have um, done the inner work that you needed to do. So if you are single and you have been waiting for someone to come in, it could certainly come in this, this week. This person is not your usual type. They don't look like your usual type. They don't act like your usual type. And it's going to be someone that is very unexpected. I feel as though, you know, um, there is a new beginning here that leads to something solid, stable, and secure. I feel like you were not accepting any opportunities for a period of time because you were working on yourselves. I couldn't accept right now because I wasn't uh, prepared. I wasn't ready. Um, but it feels as though you guys have severed some ties with the past and now you, you are moving forward very quickly. It's like you're running away. I'm running away from, from the past. I'm not looking back. I, I'm out of here. And I feel like because you guys have done the inner work, you have taken the time to really focus on you, that the wheel is spinning in your favor. You are receiving some bout of good luck. Okay. This is a change. This is fate. This is the hand of fate that is bringing you something solid, something stable and secure and wonderful. This is something that you have manifested through your period of solitude, okay? This is something that you have obtained because you have done your inner work. And I feel as though um, victory and success is right around the corner in regards to love, Okay, I feel like you guys have taken back control of your life and you are standing up. You're standing up for yourself. You're standing very strong. I feel like you've gained a lot of wisdom through some sort of reflection. Okay, wisdom through reflection. And this wisdom has um, given you the skills to let go of power struggles, okay, because fives and conflicts and insecurities, okay, I feel like there has been some, some insecurities that you needed to work on, and because you have taken the time and you haven't been focusing on anything but, and I think you've been only been focusing on yourself, now you are ready for this new beginning, you're ready for this new stable, secure commitment, so I feel like there's a new unexpected um, opportunity in love here. I do. I feel like this is love. For some of you, it could be money. Okay. This could be a job. But I feel like either way, there is a new beginning here. And this is on a, something on a tangible level. It is the middle card. This is the Ace of Pentacles. You are receiving something very wonderful. And it is something that you have manifested. This could be a new career. It could be uh, new money. 
getting some money from somebody, or it can be a new partnership. This can even be a tangible gift. This could be a house. This could be a car. Something big. You guys are receiving something very big because you have done your inner work. Okay? Um, there's a lot of uh, respect here. Okay, this is the Six of Wands. There's a lot of respect. This is this could be uh, recognition from the outside world. Maybe somebody is recognizing your hard work, or this is you. I feel like I feel like it's somebody else. I feel like there is somebody recognizing the work that you have done. And the, you know, this person that comes into your life may may be somebody that appreciates you for who you really are. Okay, they they will respect you. They will um, they'll see your confidence. They'll they'll see your your worth. Okay, I just I really feel like you know the hand of fate is spinning in your favor. You guys are starting a new chapter. There's some sort of change of course because you guys have earned it. You've earned it. You have you have done the work that you needed to do to let go of insecurities and you took the time you needed to let go of these securities okay there was a time of discontent and boredom like this card says that pushed you into this solitude this is the past present future the past is you had to go through this period of solitude and discontent to, and boredom, boredom to get rid of this conflict and defeat, okay? To let go of your fears, to sever the ties with the past. So this is what the past is. You have severed the ties. Now that you have severed the ties, you are no longer feeling left out in the cold. You are bringing securities you are tending to your own securities, okay? You still have them. You still have them. This is the five of pentacles. Yes, you still have these insecurities. But I think it's the end of secure insecurities. You're coming out of the darkness. And because you've done the work, now you are receiving a reward. This is a, this is the ace of pentacles is one of the hands of God. God is coming in saying, okay. You've manifested this. You've manifested this from your solitude. You've manifested this because you have, you've, stand, you've stood strong. You have brought stability and security back to your life. You made the decision to work this out. Decision to work this out. And because you have done the work, you are receiving some sort of reward from the universe. And it's destiny. You guys are receiving a, a, you know, whatever's happening is bringing you something very good, okay? Good luck is on its way. You're about to start a new chapter, and it's beautiful. You guys are, are absolutely receiving something that you deserve, okay? The, the wheel is spinning now, okay? The wheel is spinning now. You should start to be receiving rewards. Here is the future. Victory and success with someone who will respect you, they will see your worth. They will bring out the confidence in you. They will make you feel very, very good. This person is not your usual type. They will help you to restore balance and harmony. And they will help you to build a strong foundation. Okay? You could be dealing with an Aries or a Gemini in the future. I feel as though the because you have done the work, you are about to receive some unexpected news in regards to a new partnership that is going to be very solid, secure, and harmonious. And that's what you have, Taurus. April 1st through the 7th. Talk to you later. 8th. April 1st through the 8th. Unexpected choice in love.